Uncle. Ryan became an uncle <laughs> yesterday. <Yeah. laughs> uncle became a Ryan. Uncle became a Ryan Tio. <laughs> so it's the first little baby Seacrest in the family. We have a very small family. It's just my sister, myself, my mom, and my dad. Really, that's right. it. So we can all fit in and one And your sister's car. husband, who also helped. Yeah. <laughs> right. Right, and and my brother in law it's all new to me, my right. brother-in-law, because she right. it was the first to get married. So um, she had the baby six minutes after we got off the air. <gasps> you yeah. are kidding. I know, I said, come on, you could have done like. Yeah, next year she's going to have to time that Time better. it a little, right. you know, 15 minutes earlier, just mm -hmm. for the inbox. So her name is Flora Marie. I'm oh. going to show you a picture. Flora Marie, right there. That's... That's the happy family, oh, Jimmy Meredith and Flora Marie. What a beauty. It, and look at your sister who looks amazing. Look oh my that. gosh. I, don't, I mean, I can't even look at it, it makes me cry. Um, By the way, can I ask a question? Is that her hospital gown? Because if that's her hospital gown, that is chic. Yeah, it, it is her hospital gown. I don't, you know, I don't. Well, that's a good hospital. Yeah, it's got a nice pattern, right? You know, hospital gowns are usually like partial inmate, partial hospital. You know, it's like very institutional. <laughs> She's got a fashion pattern yeah, on there. Yeah, that's nice. I really like it. Good I mean, for her. I mean, baby has such a chubby little cheeks. She's it's really so cute. Mark and I stared at her picture last night for a long time, probably longer than we should have, you know, for not being relatives at all. <laughs> <laughs> such a... You know, Look the fact that cheeks. she was able to, like, the fact that she was able to get her out shows you that she's well, a strong lady right there. That's a strong woman. I learned so much in the last 24 hours about women and, <laughs> and birth because you'll know all of this, but so it was new to me. So she was on her way to the hospital at 6 a.m. She then had the baby at 10.06. That's incredible. She went from a <clears throat> six to a 10, like that they said. Yeah. Right, I didn't know what that meant. Yes. It's very impressive, right? It's impressive. But now I do know. You know too much. It's I fear that this may affect your ability to have your own children no. someday. No. Oh, oh, so Jimmy, so Jimmy tells me that he was asked to participate. Oh, to cut. To cut, and also he was holding her one. Leg. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But he kept his. He's. He's telling me this. I'm like in my bed last night, getting ready to go to sleep, looking at the pictures, and I decide to call yeah. one more time just yeah, to yeah. check on them. Yeah. And he t walks me through the whole thing. But he's, with the leg, he still kept his gaze upward, right? He didn't. I don't think so. You know, you, he went down? I think so. Huh. <laughs> he's, I mean, but he's like the most poised. Uh, let me just read this text. I always say watching a baby come out is kind of like being in a nightclub in the daytime. <laughs> You know what I mean? You yes, go, we oh, do. whoa. <laughs> well, it's so pretty with all the lights on. But now, that, uh, now that daylight has come in through the cracks. I will give this second thoughts yeah, next yeah. time we want to go out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, this was a, a text that he, a group text that he sent to everybody, and it just, like, it struck me, and I read it last night before I went to sleep. It says, I'm so, if I can get through it. Okay, you can do I'm it. so proud of Mama Mare today. She was so strong, and our daughter, Flora, is absolutely beautiful. So proud to be her father. That's the part that <laughs> I can't do that. You do that. Okay. I'm so proud to be her father, and it was so special seeing her meet all of her grandparents today. Next, it will be her Uncle Rye. Now watching Mare complete her first feeding, an amazing, life-changing day. Love you all.